Hello everyone and welcome back to Throtty and Clean. And we killed Asag, so now we're just gonna clean this whole thing up and then Throtty can go and have fun in the Empire. And I think Conrich is just gonna keep killing Kislevites because he's doing a great job with it. Besides that, we're trying to get some more money because in 5 turns we'll get our tier 5 units in like every category. So we're just gonna have to figure out a good way to get it to our guys after that. But I think we're pretty ready to just pass the turn. Besides, I just skip a, skipped a commandment that we needed to set, and I think we're having a rebellion somewhere. That's fine, we'll deal with that. Oh shit, Mother Ostanke is gonna join in on the fun. I suppose that was just a matter of time, considering who they're friends with. So, Conrich got some work ahead of him. At least we have a river separating us, so there's that. Prague is gonna have to do some heavy lifting, though. Oh shit. Uh, I guess this is where the rebellion is happening. Can we not win this though? I think we can win this. Let's just bump the food a little bit. I mean, these are anti-infantry, but we got some spears. It is a siege battle, so... With full wall strength. Yeah, okay, I, I think we can definitely win this. Damn rebels coming into my, my home, trying to steal my shit? I don't think so. So, let's uh, put a clan rat there. And I guess, uh, I guess a clan rat here. We can, we can always run them up if we need to. But they might send something over here. And I guess same with you. Just activate the towers so we can just sit and shoot at them. We got artillery, we can just... Uh, Put them over here. Put them on the bridge. Perfect. <laughs> Actually, kind of want them to shoot right away, so put them right there. That's ought to be fine. And then just put the spares by the gates, because that's where the where the cab is gonna go. And same with you. Although they might run down here, but we got plenty of menaces from below, so it'll be fine. Although, they seem to be sending everything over here. So yeah, just use the menace from below, send him on up. Just hold the damn towers and we'll be fine. And it looks like they are gonna try to climb the walls, so we send up some clan rats. That sh we should be able to hold that pretty well. And yeah, this is... This was very ambitious for the AI, because I do not see them winning, winning this. Oh, and the, the kitty just really want to come inside. <laughs> it's cold and wet outside, and it's full of warp stones. Are you shooting? Shoot at that. But yeah, even if they come inside, the spares are going to deal with this pretty much fine. Let's just put up a clan stone, heal a little bit. And yeah, we're all right. And they're just about to break through. We got our we got our Skaven spears here, ready to go. And just swarm the little kitty, poor little cat. Oh shit! Don't <laughs> don't do that. That's how we're gonna lose. Um, I guess we can just. Oh, never mind. Yeah, there were no there was no way they were gonna win that with that army. That's just that's just Kisna being the absolute champion of auto resolves. So grab the money. And I guess they're still alive. But oh, that took a while to actually pop over. But that's gonna be alright. So, you can just start marching. And get to Zoy... Zoy Schenk as fast as possible. It's gonna be alright. And you're just gonna go... Go and heal in Chebokov. Okay, good. Nothing is dying. Excellent. So, yeah. Just sit and heal. You got such a good replenishment. Especially since we gave these guys just nasty replenishment. They're gonna be fine. Ooh! Doom Flares! I do like Doom Flares. But uh, maybe we should save the money for when we can actually get our good stuff. Oh, and right, you needed a level. And you're just gonna need replenishment. I gotta be fine. 
And I guess we can give some magic attacks to to Throt, just, <laughs> just collect all of the weapon modifier. Um, otherwise we're going... Nah, let's, let's grab that. It's decent damage. And you're auto-leveling. You got your Plague Furnace, so... I mean... Winds of Magic is good, but I guess it's just capacity. It's not very, very useful. So let's just get you some attack. And you need one more point to get your mark, so... Hey, Weapon Strength. And I don't think you matter, so... I guess Steel Technology, we might go around doing that. But that's fine. Oh, shit, the Commandment. Uh, oh, it's this. So, get some control there. This is gonna probably stabilize now. What's the other, though? Why do we have negative 13 from other? What the shit? I have no idea why that is. It's not of you. No. Okay. <laughs> I have no idea why you're so mad then. That's uh, alright. Let's just pass the turn. Oh, yeah. This is gonna keep happening. Wait. Oh, they're on the other side of the river now. Well, she's gonna have to die. That's alright. Oh, right. Fucking Mother of Stanka. Uh, she's just been sitting and building up her curses this entire game. So, yeah. We're not winning this one. At least she's using a lot of her <laughs> things, but I'm betting she's got lots more to go, so... Hopefully she'll use them on uh, settlements before... before fighting us. Oh, hello. Defensive Alliance. Right. Um... Sure. I guess that's about as much money we're gonna get from you. I've been meaning to get a Defensive Alliance with you to take more money from you, but... I guess this is as good as it gets. So we're just gonna take it just so we can get a better uh, confederation eventually. And yeah, <laughs> things are just kind of falling apart over here. That's all right. We're, we're getting there eventually. And we are moving over, so... Um, we are gonna have to deal with you though before you become an even bigger problem so get out of here grab the money and we can still get there in two turns excellent and as long as they're just uh, taking stuff down here I don't really care it's more if they start going up here which they are probably gonna do I never did get defenses in Svedora. But this is actually really good defensive units. So we can probably do some amazing stands there, especially since they're mostly Cossars. So I think we'll be alright. We might lose some of these, but it's not a huge deal. This they won't be able to take. So that's good. And we're just saving money. I'm not gonna spend any more right now. And yeah, just just move towards Erengrad. Actually, can we get there normal? We can. So just move up normally and uh, fill up on mana. We're healthy enough. And his Y is still going though. Well, that's fun. But yeah, we can't... Oh, oh because, right. We stepped out of Encamp and uh, or we stepped out of uh, garrison with you, so you're gonna be a little bit more expensive. That's why money went down, I think. But yeah, hopefully you'll go west rather than north. But we're 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 gonna have to go and deal with that. Oh, hello! Oh, thank God, because <laughs> I know they're very high ranked. So not aggression pact sounds. Perfect. I do not want to deal with you. 
Okay, so she is actually going in north, and she is spending all of her damn curses and hexes and stuff. But I guess this is fine. Better they spend it on garrisons than on my armies, but... I have a little worrying suspicion that she has more than enough to keep this going. It is just a close defeat, so that's nice, but... I don't think we can win this considering... All of the de debuffing she's doing, so... Let's just let the AI do the damage we can. Hey, we killed the Kossar, so that's nice. And just... Be ha oh! She just... Just sacked it. Okay, well, I'm alright with that. Alright. So, um... Wait, where's Conrich? There he is. So, let's start by taking Soyhenk. Soyshenk. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> let's go and take it. Whatever it's called. Let's loot and occupy it. It's gonna be alright. And what is up with our income? It is real low. I guess we are being conquered and sacked and all of that stuff. I guess that has something to do with it. At least... Yeah, well, at least your replenishment isn't great. So you're not gonna keep be able to keep doing this. So that's good. And... Oh, is that... Um, is that Azag? Oh yeah, okay. Asag is back, and he's protecting Erengrad, so... Yeah, we... Might wanna... <laughs> I mean... We got good replenishment, but I don't think... We should just take high casualties, so... I guess we're just gonna fight this, grab a couple of menace from below, and... Uh, go and kill Asag. Again. And I guess most of our battles are just gonna be siege battles, because... For some reason... The game just won't let me do anything else. But we have lots of stuff that just want to go and punch gates. So I think we're doing this in like two groups. Let's send uh, those guys together. They'll go over there. That'll be group two because two and one just makes sense. Grab that. We'll grab the help it abomination because it's sweet. And just a couple of clan rats. There we go. And the rest is just gonna be here. There we go. Perfect. Bunch you up a little bit. Okay, well, maybe we shouldn't bunch you up a little bit. There are still towers there. There we go. Perfect. And I guess you shouldn't be pounding gates, though. But the rest of you, you can just uh, go and hit the gate. You go and uh, sit and shoot. And just fast forward. Because there's not much we're gonna be able to do until the gates go down. Oh, and of course they're gonna summon a bunch of bony boys, so they're gonna trick us to get inside. Well, these guys can absolutely deal with it though. Although he might be dealing with it a little bit too much. Because <laughs> uh, here comes Azag. Um, did we bring the caster here? But we can't cast inside anyway. So, let's get ourselves a over... Oh, shit, he's on the other side. Crap. Uh, let's get an overcast of plague, like, right there. Right, right there. And just murderize these things. Let's see, you need to... Creature killer. I guess we'll do that too, and just molder you up. And there we go. The big rat is here to spread some plagues. It is a really cool looking, looking spell though. And it is doing a little bit of work, so that's nice. Can anyone else get inside? Oh! No? Okay, never mind. This is open already. Sweet! So, let's go and fight over there. Um, I guess uh, let's shut down some some archers. And uh, you actually got like, a full heal from, uh, from remoldering. Sweet! Are you gonna... Are you gonna fight the gatehouse or not? <laughs> I guess we never... We don't even have to get to fight this because they keep the damn door open. So, I guess just keep trying. It'll be alright. Get in and fight. 
And let's get some some of those on the other side. That's gonna be fine. And I mean, these guys are doing great. They might just kill everything over here and uh, we'll just capture this and walk through, hopefully. Although these guys died from towers. <laughs> That's all right. We we're planning to replace them anyway. And you're taking forever with that. Let's just get some breaths through there instead. Get a summon. And just keep pushing. And now you can pestilent burst. There we go. And yeah, let's just go and capture this. I guess you're busy. So pop all of those. And these are pretty... Yeah, those, those are armor piercing anyway, so... Pop the brew. The brew. Oh, wait, these can cap? There's summons, they shouldn't be able to cap. No, okay. We seem to be capping this. <laughs> Just keep punching the damn gate, please. <laughs> Wish we had a clan stone because uh, we've been getting shot at here. There we go. Now we're doing all right. You can get in there and fight if you can. Oh, actually, let's uh, pop some of those over there. Let's stop them from shooting. That's fine. Oh, god damn it. We stepped off. <laughs> well, let's get some rat ogres in there. And just get you working on this. At the very least, we're punching in through here, and Azag is almost dead. So that's nice. And the trolls, too. Oh, you. Go kill Azag. Get him, Gorich. Let's get one hit in, and he's down. Oh, I think he's down. Excellent. Beautiful. So that's gonna do wonders for their leadership. Go there and fight. Um, some of you go around up there. The rest of these guys, who's not walking on over, send you up there. You're gonna be all right. Oh, hey, we're through. Excellent. Get up there. Some of you get over there, though. Oh, stay and fight these biggins. Sweet. <laughs> we did, barely did any damage to the gate, too. But you get us get you into the boiny boy, boiny boys, boiny boys, and bust that open. Oh, and you're taking loads of damage here. But just get on up there. Get another summon in there. Just mess them up. And let's go and help out with that. Let's finally get these rats in here to help on out. Oh, where are you standing still? Get up there. And you should be fine with that. And if we can just break through this, we're gonna be good here. We're taking a lot of damage from towers though, which I'm not a fan of. Oh, and can you not just break down that barricade? There we go. This one is down. Get in, boys. And that one is down. So get on in there. And that should be our losses. Yeah, nice. Uh, a little bit messy, but <laughs> fine. Just really annoying with the gatehouse. Wait, are you not? Oh, they have bony boys that's just crumbling. But everything else is pretty much dead. And I keep forgetting about this pestilent breath. God damn it. <laughs> so there we go. Brute force. And <laughs> there we finally lost our night runners. That's alright. We're gonna replace them with just poison wind uh, uh, storm fiends. So who cares? It's not like I've really been <laughs> using them. 
<laughs> They've just been hanging around. But what are we leveling you? You got pretty much everything we want you to have. I mean, I guess some of these are... Whatever. Yeah, I don't think any of these really does anything for us. So, I'm just gonna auto-level you from now on. Master Engineer! And, yeah, we're just gonna make you better... Okay, yeah, we're gonna take the armor here, right? <laughs> just get you to 180 armor. <laughs> Nothing non-armor piercing is getting through that. <laughs> so, I guess we're losing Yaren. That's a fine. And we're probably gonna lose that too. But that's fine. And by that time, Conrich should be getting here and just starting murdering things. Because we're just going to ignore this for now. We need to deal with these Kistalites. So, wait. How many turns left was this? We are one on you, but nothing you make is going to go to Throt. But the Doom Bomber, I'm so excited for that one. Otherwise, it is uh, two more turns. And yeah, we're... We're starting to build up a nice little bank here, so we're just gonna we're just gonna make as much money as we can in two turns, and uh, oh yeah, speed, and then we're gonna start recruiting. And I guess what we could do is just uh, recruit a second lord, sit and globally recruit for him, but then simultaneously maybe get another lord and recruit some for him. Although, he might have to wait a little bit for his bomber. Because we still have to have the income to actually sustain it. And wait, what isn't... Oh! Grab that. And I guess repair that. Because this might stabilize. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> we'll see. I guess we can build a... Platform, and then it will stabilize. So that's fine, because this should be fairly safe. Pro wait, where's the... where's the chip? Wait, alright. <laughs> I thought this was Castle Alexandrov and I'm just bad at reading, I guess. <laughs> oh, Cetra. Military access. Well, we already have a non-aggression pact, so I don't think we need that. And yeah, that's fine. We're almost there. Oh, maybe we can reach him, actually. But Kairos is absolutely huge. <laughs> he has been just doing amazingly. And I'm trying to find, like... Where is his capital? Can I... Wait, can I just... Oh, it's in there. Probably. Most likely. And we still have four turns before we can make an under-empire, so yeah, let's just go and explore in there, make an... Oh, and I forgot to empty that out, that's alright. I did want some hell pit abominations anyway. Oh, and we can reach Vitsi, but not Sidovskve. So I guess this is more important, just get Kisle out of here. That is their capital, though. But yeah, let's uh, let's go and take Vitzi. Let's get him out of here. Very good. Now the question. Oh yeah. Oh. Hello, Kairos. What are you doing here? Oh, I guess you're fighting the Bone Rattlers. So you're. Going towards Soydovsk? We don't have a lot of military access with you. Alright, so you're gonna you're gonna make us mad, I suppose. That's alright. Well, let's go and kill you. Which turns out wasn't uh, wasn't the the beastman. But the beastman is around here. There no oh, wait, okay, there were <laughs> one settlement over. I thought they were right there, but I guess not. So I guess just uh, go and sit in Yarin. Serena is moving in, but it seems like Mother Ostankia just retreated, which is good. 
But we need to kill you next turn and start murdering you. But that's all right. We do need to deal with you. Could probably go and take this out next turn though, but I don't think it matters. I think we'd rather just go and take that out. And then we kind of just go south with you and leave this to uh, to Conrich. Yeah, I think that's fine. I'm okay with that. Oh, it, everyone keeps attacking Katcherk or however you're supposed to pronounce that. But yeah, just... Yeah, let's take it. Well, we're on our way. So, I guess we did find these guys a couple of turns ago, so we should probably just make some deals with them. There we go. Who else want to make a deal? Oh, we got some orcs that might want to be friends, but nah, I don't care. Kemri still wants to be friends. Clan Spitel wants a defensive alliance, so... You know what? Yeah, give me your money. And, oh! We can just confederate them. They do only have one settlement. And let's actually have a look at that settlement. Because we should be able to see what they got. They have... Oh, it's a five, tier 5 settlement. Sweet. And they even have a special mine. <laughs> um, Yeah. Cool. Yeah, I think we're just gonna... We're just gonna confederate you then. Yeah. Excellent. So that is gonna just drop our control for five turns, but I'm sure it's gonna be fine. We're gonna get uh, 500 gold, which isn't which isn't great, but it's not terrible. Probably don't need this. I mean, it gives us uh, storm vermin, which isn't bad because we are gonna need to have a good garrison here, because I'm expected. Or I'm expecting one of these dwarves are gonna declare war on us, like, instantly. So it's probably a good idea to have some garrisons. Oh, we get death glows from that. And clan rats. Warfire throwers, sweet. And... Get a doom wheel of warp lightning cannons. Some plague monks and a plague priest. Yeah, I think this is what has to go. And we'll just uh, probably build garrison here, because we are going to need a garrison. If we can even get it up before the dwarves comes to kill us. So, oh, can we actually... I think we can reach you. Oh, come on. Please. Please give me an ambush. Otherwise, they're just going to run away. Please. Oh, God fucking damn it. <laughs> Oh, I hate you so much. I hate the beastmen so much. Okay, so they're just gonna get away and there's nothing we can do about it. And we can't just ignore them because... Yeah, they're... God, I hate the beastmen so much. <laughs> um, does any of you have block army? No, oh, let's just hinder replenishment. Oh, you have block army. Oh, right. 45% chance. Shit. Okay. Well, that didn't work. <laughs> uh, well, do you have any... Yeah, we do have a lord over here. Nope, that's not what I meant to do. Let's get rid of you because you're expensive. And let's start recruiting some stuff for uh, Throt. So, who is our cheapest... Well... You would have been good, but I guess you're... I just disbanded you, so... Oh, we do have Hellkeek. So, let's grab him. He's even level 8. Oh, shit. He's... I have no loyalty, though. So, he might just rebel. I mean, he was free, though. And we get a thousand gold for it. So, please don't rebel. Um... Yeah, okay. I was hoping we could get that, but he's spent it. Of course he has. Makes sense, though. I guess we could just uh, do like that. They're free, so that might help your loyalty. And I just want to get... I just want to get the wind launchers. And I guess we can get a rattling gun. 
just because they're sweet. And if he rebels, I guess we're just gonna have to start this again with someone else, but I do think we get the refund if he... if he rebels. So yeah, we're just gonna have to hunt you down. At least the closest settlement isn't part of this thing. So we can we can hunt him and then turn down and towards the Kislevites. And uh, I guess once you're done recruiting, we can just go around settling stuff with you. Because I think Throt might have to start going and helping out in the east. At least taking out the... I guess we can do that right now. Although, they're gonna build up an army here and just go and be a menace over here instead, so yeah. We're gonna have to... <laughs> We're just gonna have to put up fires there. Oh, oh shit. I keep forgetting about the mutagen. <laughs> okay, everything is fine. Don't worry about it. And you don't have any, so... Some armor in you wouldn't be bad, since uh, you're kinda squishy. We could just make you a burrowing bomb. <laughs> just uh, burrow you into a blob of things and just explode you. Okay, that is definitely what we're doing. I don't remember if this actually does damage to him. <laughs> Honestly, I don't care. <laughs> I just want to explode him. So yeah, let's uh, give him some tankiness as well. Yeah, I think that's going to be great. And that puts us in a more reasonable position. So yeah, let's just uh, let's just pass the turn. And uh, actually, is there anything else they have that costs us money right now? Those two are all our things. That's who we're trying to block with. And you, we do not need. So disband you. And as I yeah, he wants out. Oh, is he already back? Okay, he's already sitting. Damn, he recovers fast. We killed him like two turns ago. And yeah, I fucking called it. Of course, they're attacking the turn after we get there. I mean, it makes sense. They hate our guts, but yes. <laughs> Goddamn dwarves. You can't trust them. And yeah, they're gonna go and take Zenilev. That's gonna have to be alright. There's nothing we can do about that. And then they're just gonna hide, I suppose. And heal kick is... Uh, well, I guess we can get some loyalty here. We seem to have gotten him a loyalty, thanks to giving him just Caven Slaves. So yeah, I'll accept their help. I should have read that though. I like reading those events. But, oh well. Still no capital, but I'm betting they have like a tier 5 settlement over there somewhere. Okay, and they're definitely right over there, right? <laughs> right come on, let me find you. Um, I guess we just uh, march stance next to him, kinda. And there we go. Now we found him. Block him. Yeah, and now we got him. So, we should be able to catch him next turn. Good. And yeah, you're going to Yetich. It's gonna have to be alright. Well, you're gonna go and help with that soon. So, we'll be alright. We'll be alright. It'll be alright. <laughs> <laughs> um, do we... No, we don't want to spend any money right now. We just want our Storm Fiends. And we're gonna want to go and take this out. Oh, and there's... A lot of stuff. So, yeah. Let's go and kill Asag for, like, the third time. Okay. This is not the last time we're gonna see Asag, I think, though. Because, uh, still think he has some stuff down south. But, they are just... Big old line. Makes sense. Perfectly fine orc... Uh, no, wait. Oh. Uh, perfectly fine orc strategy. We're gonna send you up the flank, because you can definitely handle it yourself and probably take out this whole flank by yourself. I think you guys are gonna sit you in the center, because Asag is fucking scary, man. And just spread out some clan rats. 
Like so. And Skater Slides. It's fine. Group 1. You'll hang out close by as well. You can just hang back and we'll we'll find a blob for you to teleport and explode in. Oh, I'm so I'm so excited to try it out. Um, you are group four. We'll just send you up the flank. And um, this. No, that's not what I meant to do. Did I hold shift? Well, either way, these guys are just gonna help in the center because this is gonna be there's gonna be a lot of fighting in there. I can go with you. And yeah, good. Send you up. And let's just get some rat poppers. There we go. Keep moving. Send you into some wolf riders. And uh, yeah, let's just hunt those guys. It's gonna be fine. Uh, move you up. And move you up. Good. And yeah, let's just hunt this. Might actually be able to sandwich them. It's gonna be fine either way. Oh, hello. Go and murder that. You go and help out with that, because apparently we're gonna be fighting lots of things over there. Oh, well, that... That hurts a little bit. That was... That was hurtful of you. And... Get some rat ogres. We're gonna just... Chop through that real quick. And get on top of Azag. Get on top of Azag. We can't let him do his thing. Um, let's get a breath through there. Get some of these. And probably just get a big wither here as well. There we go. Oh, <laughs> he is. Oh, he is getting just ruined. <laughs> get him, Helfit. You got him. Come on. You can do it. <laughs> he is so low. Um, Alright. Let's... Uh, no, thanks. Send you in over there. Uh, you don't need to chase that. Just get on killing. And... Explode. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, that is awesome. Oh, I love that. Oh, I need I need to get more exploding things. <laughs> that, was, that was sweet. Uh, let's get these guys into the archers. We can almost get some more houndos. Let's send you in over there. And, oh, you you guys are not fighting. You should all be fighting. Why are you not fighting? And yeah, nasty skulkers are gonna kill our wolf rats. That's fine. They are very temporary. Ah, no, 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 no. You, you, you stay there. <laughs> you went through the thing I asked you to attack. But yeah, we're uh, we're good here. I was just one explosive, uh, well, kind of literally, literally, one very explosive uh, start of the fight, and then it was kind of just over. But that doesn't mean you should stop fighting. You, you, you keep fighting. You, you do your thing. And let's kill those nasty skulkers. Ah, just ruined them. Sweet. Uh, we got some clan rats breaking to Arab boys. Makes sense because Arab boys are fucking scary up front. But yeah, there we go. <laughs> clan rats are not doing well, but I don't need them to. I just need the bony boys to die, though. There we go. And I mean, as I guess, pretty dangerous, but <laughs> just instantly murdered. By our little murder squad here. And we did lose a clan rat and a wolf rat. Honestly, it's fine. Don't really care about it. And this is not a walled settlement, so I don't really care about spending any food. And we got a big cap, so I think we're all right. Ooh. That's pretty cool. Just uh, give me some block chance for everything in a blob. Neat. So let's uh, let's start getting the actually let's get to deadly onslaught and then we'll grab the red tree. Uh, it's gonna be fine. 
And right, you and you are leveling automatically. You just keep grabbing that. And hey, finally got the Chosen of Corn. About time. Do we need... Well, we do have... Oh! Fucking cheaper Storm Fiends. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> we absolutely need that. Sweet. So, hopefully we can cra crab you. We can grab you. Uh, you're done in three turns. So, yeah. We're just gonna... Oh, you might be getting ready to attack us here. Yeah. We might have to go down and kill Boris, like, next turn. Who are you at war with? Oh, only Kairos. Okay, so I think we can get some good deals there as well then. But yeah, we are... We're gonna have to go and probably preemptively do some of that. Got some rebellions happening. Oh, over here. I, am I guess that's fine. <laughs> it's not much we can do about that. Keep taxing that. And yeah, they're going deeper. Not a fan. But it's alright, so far. Oh, you went to the others? No, wait, that's not Mother of Stankia. You're just, you're just all equally ugly. That's fine. We're on our way there. They still didn't take it for some reason. Weirdos. And Clan Fester wants an aggression pact. Hey, look, it's back for more. Sure. What we do in the shadows? Hell, Keek. Uh, clan Ashen, the Clan Ashen rats have come from the dark again, asking that their efforts to aid to be come. Okay. The Clan Ashen rats have come from the dark again, asking that their efforts to. The Clan Ashen rats have come from the dark again, asking that their efforts to aid you be compensated. They want payment, and they want it now. All right. Well, heel kick is. Uh, it's all right. I'll just, I'll just lose a little bit of loyalty. It's all right. And this is, is that not Crookback Mountain? I think this is Crookback Mountain. No, wait, that's Crookback Mountain. Never mind then. Um, let's go and probably put in, put a undercity in Caracas Karak, Karaka Karak. The thing, the thing with the place. <laughs> and. Get these dwarves out of here. Why why is it even dwarves? This is weird. Well, that's fine. They're done in two turns. And I guess Boris left. That's probably good for us. And Did you Did you manage to underway all the way up over there actually? God I hate the beastmen! I hate them so damn much. <sighs> Alright, well, let's start moving east. Let's keep on top of you, keep blocking you. Oh, we failed. That's alright. But at least, uh, at least we're covering a little bit if they try to underway over here, but god damn it, I hate them. <laughs> they are. Ah. <sighs> Yep, yep. Beastman. Oh, that's that's a weird attack. I mean, I get that you want Svedora, but maybe you should pick your battles. This is not something you win. So yeah, I mean, I'll, I'll take it. That makes some things a lot easier, at least, because now we don't have to worry about Catherine, but. Honestly, a little bit disappointed, because that that just that just feels cheap. <laughs> and Clan Grictus, yeah, I'm not gonna join your stupid dwarf war. Would like the money, but yeah, I, I don't think it's worth it. Right, we should actually probably check if we're being sieged over here. No, okay. Well, in that case, uh, let's build a garrison. Probably should have done that. Wait, how many turns? Yeah, okay, I've been <laughs> I've been skipping like three turns. So we should have had two more turns on that. But at least that's almost gone. 
Um, we're done with this next turn. But we really need to tear that down, so... I think we're just gonna get moving, and you should be able to just... Well, you're just gonna march after anyway and start uh, colonizing these. Oh! They crossed the river! Um, oh, that's nice! Can we... Can we block ya? No. But we can probably... Okay. So if we attack here, they're probably just gonna run across the river and we're not gonna reach them. So I guess if we... Yeah, if we go at this angle... Maybe we get an ambush anyway, but this way they shouldn't run across the river. Oh, we got the ambush! Yes! <laughs> and, uh, I mean, I know this is... We really don't need to fight this manually, but I am so sick of these beastmen that I think I'm gonna do that anyway. But we're probably gonna do that next episode. So, yeah, we're gonna have some catharsis next episode. So, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye!